This goes out to my friends in the Resilience Book Club. One day, a boy looked out his window and noticed a caterpillar's cocoon hanging on a leaf. He was so excited. And so every day, he'd come home and he'd make sure the cocoon was good. Nothing really happened for several days until one day he noticed just the tiniest little hole in the cocoon. This was it. It was starting. He checked back for the next couple of days and maybe there was a little movement, but the hole wasn't getting any bigger. Surely by now something would be poking out, right? The boy started to get concerned after a few more days and impatient and wanted to help. So he took out his pocket knife and made the tiny hole just a little bit bigger, making sure not to hurt whatever was inside. A couple days went by, no real change, but the hole wasn't getting bigger again. So he took out his knife and made it just a little bit bigger. A few more days, no real change, took out his knife, made it just a little bit bigger. And all of a sudden it started to move and it started to wiggle. This was it, this was it. And out of the cocoon came a pile of goo. No longer a caterpillar, definitely not a butterfly. It turns out that caterpillars need the resistance of the cocoon. The cocoon keeps them inside until they are fully formed. And the struggle to get out is actually what strengthens the structure of the butterfly wings. Without weeks and weeks of resistance and hardship inside the cocoon, the wings don't become viable and the caterpillar never really transforms. I'm reading a book right now that explains that transformation almost inevitably requires real struggle caused by change. Sometimes we're comfortable or timid where we are. Sometimes we lack the imagination of what could be. Sometimes that change or challenge was not our choice. But for whatever reason, we stay put until the challenge or change happens. The trick is to look past the current circumstance and embrace the struggle, what the military calls embrace the suck, because transformation only happens through struggle. So the next time that you are in a dark place and struggling, let me tell you what the caterpillar wishes it could hear. You're not going to believe what the new you looks like when you get through this. Right now, this is tough. But I promise that you have something to look forward to after that will make it worth it. See you next Monday.